Hi guys, welcome back to Pop and Glamour. Today let's check out how to use different animations to make this countdown timer. So please stay tuned. Okay, so let's go back to the presentation. If you see, I have two rectangles here. One rectangle here in the background. We can make this and uh, put some color and another rectangle on top of it so this is the rectangle that we need to animate and it has uh, two lines placed like this and it also has a couple of circles to give it a design okay so let's have it here um, and then we need some numbers to animate so I have the pictures of the numbers here let's copy it from here Okay, so these numbers are the digital numbers so I have converted them into pictures you can also download this let me delete this slide you can also download this from the internet I'll give you the link in the description so it gives you that digital clock effect okay let's uh, put them aside now let's go to business let's select the number five first okay, before that just click on the rectangle and then need to animate this first okay so select this and then go to animations and in animations you will have to select the wheel animation under the entrance under the entrance select wheel if you see this wipes and rotates like a wheel so it gives you that countdown effect and make sure the duration is set to one second because we need it every second okay so rectangle is there and then select this number five go to animations and then select up here okay so after the rectangle disappears so it should be with previous so we want the number to stay with the rectangle okay so it will start with previous and continue with the previous one okay then go to add animations and give it an exit effect okay exit disappear so we also want the number five to disappear and this disappearance should happen after the previous event is finished right so the rectangle appears and the picture which is the number five together okay and then it disappears after the rotation of the wheel is finished all right so that's the that's the animation sequence of one number and again we need a rectangle animation again so click on the rectangle and then add an animation of wheel so we want the wheel animation to appear again after the number five right so and this has to be after previous so after the number five disappears again the rotation happens so make sure it is one second so with the rotation the number four should appear along the rotation so place it in the middle exactly on top of the number five and then okay then go to animations and say appear again the same thing make sure this number four is with previous so it starts with the rectangle and continues to be with the rectangle animation okay then make sure you add an exit effect the same way like we did earlier disappear so disappear should happen after the previous one is finished okay all right and again we need after the number four is done we need the rectangle to spin again like a wheel 
Okay, the same thing. Make sure it is one second. And this should be after previous. Then turn of the number three. Number three is placed here. Again, go to animations. Entrance should be up here. And it should start with previous and ends with previous. Great. And add animation of an exit effect. So it appears with the rectangle. And once the rectangle and the number are done, it disappears after previous. Okay. Okay, then number three is done. Then the next rectangle animation happens. Select the rectangle, go to add animation and the wheel. And this should be after the number three is done. So it should be after previous. Duration one second after previous. Now the same way, drag the number two in the middle and add the same type of animations. So it will appear, the entrance is up here, it should be with the rectangle animation throughout, so it should be with previous and once it's finished animation, it should disappear. So we should add a exit animation of disappear and this should be after previous, great. Then again we need a rectangle. So to select the rectangle, go to add animation and the wheel effect. And this should be after previous again. Select the duration to one second and after previous. So the number one again. So these are the same steps. So you will see the free download link in the description. You can go ahead and download this slide to understand it better. Uh, please make sure you like this video, share and subscribe to my channel. Okay, this is after previous. Okay, so I think we are done with all the animations. We started from number five and then number one. Let's see how it looks. Start five, four, three, two, one. Thanks for watching guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye.